let's talk about how you can use Snowflake and Alteryx together to improve or enrich your data practices. So first, what is Snowflake? Snowflake is a cloud-based data warehouse, and just like any other database system, you can store relational data, and then you can also define security rules such that your information is accessible across your organization, but it's also secure. In addition, Snowflake offers a couple additional functionalities, such as the ability to store semi-structured data, for example, JSON or XML, and you can do this without having to do any pre-formatting or restructuring. You can also scale your data warehouse in Snowflake so that you can optimize the speed and performance on a case-by-case -case basis and really improve how quickly you query your data. And then because it is cloud-based, you can choose your supporting cloud platforms such as Azure, Google, or Amazon S3. And then on the cloud end of things, Snowflake will manage your database so that you don't have to. Now that we've talked about Snowflake, let's quickly discuss how you can use Snowflake and Alteryx together. So first off, you can use Alteryx to write data into your Snowflake database. For example, you can pull in data from any other sources or formats, and then you can combine and blend them or manipulate and transform them as needed, such that you have clean and complete data to push into your database. On the flip side, you can use Alteryx to pull in data from Snowflake, so you can query that data and bring it into your workflow in Alteryx and then perform any kind of analysis you need to, such as spatial or predictive or any other kind of analysis within Alteryx. And this is really great because Snowflake has a really high performance speed. All these queries happen really quickly within Alteryx. In addition, you can use Alteryx as kind of a go-between between Snowflake and any other BI tool that you can use for additional visualization or analysis. Now let's go ahead and look at a quick example. So in this Alteryx workflow, I'm reading in some third-party customer data that contains information about the number of subscribers to a particular web page. So first, what I'm going through and doing is some parsing, reformatting, filtering, and just general data cleansing. And then in this output data tool, I am pushing all this data to create a new Snowflake data table. And then I'm loading it into that database warehousing system. Once I go ahead and run this, we'll see that it executes and then we'll hop into Snowflake to look at the performance speed. So in Snowflake, when I go ahead and refresh the page, we can see that 2,000 records were loaded into my data table in just about one second. And that's pretty quick for a cloud-based kind of storage system. Now to just reiterate the processing speed, we're also gonna look at a Tableau dashboard and see how quick this updates. So I'm gonna hop over to the dashboard now. So here you can see we just have a basic chart showing how many subscribers per region, as well as a line graph illustrating the change in subscribers over time. So now we have this general view. Let's look at how our Snowflake data table updates as well as this dashboard as we push in new data. So back in my Alteryx workflow, I am pulling in six new data sources and these each contain new subscriber data for six dates. Then I'm unioning it and writing it out to that same Snowflake table and appending the information. So we'll go ahead and run this and then go back to our tablet dashboard and just see the update speed. So back in my dashboard, let's just give the query some time to reset in Tableau and bring in that refresh data. And now it's loading. And we have seen here that each region has incremented the number of subscribers and that information is updated. And to the right, we can see a spike in our new information, as well as just kind of the new trends within the line graph. So that's just a very basic use case of how you can push and pull data from a Snowflake data table and database. And just overall in this video, we've talked about how you can use Snowflake and its cloud storage platform to improve your processing speed and data warehouse environment. And then you can integrate with Alteryx to really simplify the need for SQL and instead use Alteryx drag and drop functionality and codeless environment. And then really enrich your data cleansing, data access and data analysis with Alteryx as well as communicate with Snowflake and your data access. Thank you for watching.